In this video, I will show you the tools I use to create my charcoal drawings. This is the beginner's guide on how to draw with charcoal. The paper that I use is Toned Gray Strathmore. It's great because it gives you a mid-tone to work with. Compressed charcoal pencils are my favorite. Pay attention to the different ways that these two are sharpened. One is sharpened with a knife and the other a pencil sharpener. Vine or willow charcoal, which is burnt grapevine or willow branch. Compressed charcoal also comes in stick forms. Black pan pastel is great for toning large areas very smoothly. This effect also works with powdered charcoal, but it can be very messy. I use blender stumps for softening and detail shading. Each eraser is for a different use. Electric erasers are good for fine detail. Kneaded erasers are good for lifting charcoal and don't create a mess. White rubber eraser pens in different sizes. And a white rubber block eraser. Vine charcoal produces a very light gray and is easily erasable. It is great for sketching. Compressed charcoal sticks are powdered charcoal that have been bound together using a gum or wax binding agent. They are good for very rich blacks. Compressed pencils are less messy and can be sharpened for big areas or fine detail. The white really makes your highlights pop and work right on top of black charcoal. Pastel is what I use for my sketching, and it's extremely easy to erase and very soft. Using the electric eraser at a 45 degree angle will give you very fine lines. With the kneaded eraser, you can also blot the area that you want to make lighter, and it will pick up the charcoal off the paper. You can really 
see how each eraser will be used for different effects. Taking a paper towel or napkin, you can soften the drawing to give it less grainy texture and make your drawing look more realistic. This technique can be used on white for nice even blends. going to want to doodle and really get a feel for how each material works. If you have any questions, make sure to leave a comment below. If you enjoyed my video, please give it a thumbs up and be sure to subscribe for more quality content. Thank you.